hello everyone and welcome back again to the channel how are you all doing hope you all are good hope you all are fine so in today's video we are discussing how possible a newborn will have malaria how possible a newborn will have typhoid how possible is it that this newborn can have malaria and typhoid they both appearing in um, the lab test result whenever you mistakenly expose your baby to mosquitoes you know the baby gets beaten by mosquitoes on several occasions definitely your baby is going to get infected with malaria and you didn't take care of whatsoever goes into your baby's stomach like health providers they've actually said that 80 to 90 percent of let's say infection it comes from the stomach it originates from the stomach so whenever you didn't take proper care of whatsoever goes into your baby's system definitely your baby might get infected so let's say you're bottle feeding your baby so you should take proper care of the water you give to your baby it should be properly treated and let's say you're boiling it and putting it in a vacuum flat you should boil that water properly it should be treated properly and you should handle it with care because it's what goes into your baby system even that vacuum flax you're going to use wash it properly make sure you take care of that vacuum flax if you don't clean them properly your feeding bottles if you don't clean them properly there are chances of bacteria growing inside okay growing around your uh, water bottles your feeding bottles so there are chances of bacteria growing there so whenever this baby keep ingesting all this when you, whenever your baby keep taking all this there are possibilities that this baby is going to get infected with typhoid so these are chances that your baby might get infected with all these diseases so is there a possibility that your baby will get infected with malaria yes there are possibility is there a possibility that your baby will get infected with typhoid yes there are possibilities of that happening whenever you don't take care of this baby properly or whenever you mistakenly expose this baby to all these things so you, your baby might get infected the bottom line here is you should take care of whatsoever goes into your baby's system for persons who are doing a bottle feeding for persons who are into bottle feeding you should take care of your baby's feeding bottles your baby's water bottle you should take care of all those things and you should take care of your baby's basically protect your babies to the maximum that you can protect your babies to the maximum that you can okay so are there medications for that you know pharmaceutical products industries they've advanced in such a way that newborns actually have medicines for malaria okay they have doses now for malaria medicines now if your baby is infected or your baby have malaria your baby have typhoid what are the medicines that you need to give to your baby just send me email just go to my about page and you find my email address send me emails and i'll tell you medications that you can give to your newborn so that's it from me guys see you in my next and upcoming videos for now bye